Rapid City's Building Services Division issued two building permits Wednesday, which boosted annual permit values over the $400 million mark. Our Adrian Carbajal was at City Hall today to find out why permits have been booming. Last year, Rapid City issued $364.6 million in building permits. In 2021, they set a record of $395.5 million. So why has 2023 been such a successful year with two months still to go? The city is seeing a growth pattern that we have never experienced in the history of Rapid City. In addition, the cost of construction has been on the rise. So the cost of building some of these structures a year ago, or let's say even three years ago, was less than it is today. This growth pattern Fisher talks about is not only benefiting commercial properties, but is influencing the amount of homes being built in the city. In the past two years, 295 permits for homes and another 95 permits for townhomes have been issued. We have a nice blend of both residential and commercial permits that are walking in the door. This month, we've had a nice break between apartment development, single and townhome projects still coming in, and then we've seen some significant commercial growth. The two record-breaking permits issued Wednesday are for the new Pete Lean headquarters at 3401 Universal Drive, which is valued at $17.87 million, and for a second Mr. Liquor's facility at 5312 Black Hills Boulevard, valued at $4.52 million. With nearly 12 weeks left to add to the totals and steady expansion growth, there's no telling how high this record can go. Reporting in Rapid City, I'm Adrian Carbohol.